So now we're on a desktop. So think about a $599 price point, and you've got a couple options in the marketplace. The first one could be an AMD Phenom uh, triple core uh, 8750 with the, uh, the new 780G chipset. The trade name is the ATI Radeon 3200. And the experience compared against uh, an Intel Core 2 Duo 8200 with a G45. And what we'd like to do is show uh, what it can do on Blu-ray. So there's a lot of really interesting things here, and we're watching, watching The Simpsons here. So one of the things I'd like to point to is, is the low CPU utilization on the desktop. Here you're looking at uh, 10, 20, 30 percent CPU utilization, uh, where on the competing system is actually a lot higher. And one of the reasons why this is important in a desktop is because once you get a CPU utilization above a certain threshold, your fan kicks in, the system could start to get a lot hotter. And probably more importantly, though, is you're going to need some of that extra CPU space if one of your background tasks uh, kicks in as you're watching a movie. And you know this could be Windows Defender. It could be a virus protection. Now, in this example, what we're, we're about to show you, uh, we're kicking on a iTunes audio encode, which is going from a, a WAV file into Apple's format called... Uh, AAC, which I'm sure everybody is uh, familiar with. So, and the usage scenario is you're you're watching your movie, and you're uh, you're encoding in the background, and you get uh, quite a different uh, experience. So, the AMD CPU utilization has gone up uh, a little bit. The competing Intel system has actually gone up to a hundred percent, and you're going to start to see some uh, some frame rate, some frames uh, dropping and some skipping, uh, particularly when you get into some of the higher uh, encode rate uh, videos where it gets into the uh, 40, 50, there you see uh, some of it right there. And uh, take a, a couple more uh, minutes here where it, where it actually gets uh, a little bit even more pronounced. There you can see uh, different skips uh, along the way. There's the spaceship uh, coming in and the people are walking out. Here's where it really starts to get um, a little choppy. Hmm. And uh, even as you move into this, uh, this final scene here, it really, really starts to crawl. So, you know, uh, just like we explained uh, to everybody, you know, months ago, uh, triple core processors uh, were the right thing to do for the market. It really bridged the gap between dual core solutions and quad-core solutions, and as importantly, was taking that that HD video encode uh, from the CPU uh, to the GPU, where it's actually done a lot more efficiently than just on the CPU. So all in all, we think it's a pretty good uh, solution.